Hey girl, hey, happy Tuesday. Happy Thoughtful Tuesday to each and every one of you. I hope you had an amazing day and I pray you have an even better evening. I wanted to hop on here just to take a few moments of your time to talk to you about an amazing initiative that I am working with in conjunction with my wonderful church family, the UNITY family, where we are led by Pastor Eliana Bullock, aka Pastor L. Um, she has tasked us every month through our Helping Hands initiative to find an organization in our area or a group of individuals who could benefit from a helping hand. For the month of May, my platform is partnering with the church and I am spearheading a campaign to pack a bag, pack a purse, and pay it forward. When you're doing your spring cleaning, because yes, it is that time of the year, and you find these cute little bags that you picked up from the makeup counter or the perfume counter, and you're like, what do I do with these? Don't throw them away. I want you to take them, and I want you to pack them um, with feminine hygiene products. So we're going to put pads. We're going to put tampons. We're going to put uh, feminine hygiene wipes. Also, those toiletries that you got from the hotel a couple of weeks ago, and you don't know what you want to do with them, put them in the bag. Throw in a kind note. Please, please, please. I think this is one of the most important things is to put a kind note in there. And also, if your bag is big enough, I throw in a journal and a um, pen or pencil as well. We want to um, donate these bags once they are packed. We are donating ours to um, an organization in our uh, community which benefits um, mothers and infants. It's a mother and infant home um, in the DMV area. Um, you don't have to ship your items to us. I encourage you and urge you to find um, an organization in your area that supports displaced women or is a mother and infant home and donate these items to. We have access to these items and we don't think about, you know, there's a group of individuals, a group of females who cannot readily put their hands on these items. So let's give them to them. So we're going to pack these bags. We're going to fill them with, again, pads, tampons, feminine hygiene wipes toiletries, a journal if it fits, and a kind note. And it doesn't have to be a bag this small. If you have a purse in your closet that you haven't used in like three or four years, two years, and you don't know what to do with it, pack it. Pack it and pay it forward. Find an organization in your area. Um, and if you can't find one, pack the purse anyway and put it in the trunk of your car. So when you see a displaced woman on the street, you can hand it to her. You don't even know how much that would impact her day, impact her life, okay? So again, for the month of May, we are paying it forward, we are packing purses, and we are get, we are lending a helping hand. Um, if you have any questions um, or need assistance finding an organization in your area, please feel free to shoot me an email, latreyathelifecoach at gmail.com. Um, or you can DM me here on um, whatever social media platform you're watching this on. Um, we are making our donation delivery on May 6th, and I urge you to make your delivery in conjunction with us. Um, please feel free to uh, send me photos of you making your donations. However, I ask that you be mindful of the recipients of your donations. If you are handing your donations to a displaced woman on the street, please do not record her. Please be respectful of her situation. Um, you can just say, I just made a donation, um, but we want to be um, mindful and respectful um, of everybody um, who we um, assist and everyone who's going to benefit from, from these purses. So again, join us in our Helping Hands initiative with UNITY Church. We're packing purses and we're paying it forward in the... Um, I'll put more information below um, with what is all going to be included, but I'm excited about this initiative and I hope you are too. Uh, this is the first of our Helping Hands series and I'm honored um, to be able to um, work alongside with one of my favorite people um, and some of my favorite individuals in, within our church family uh, to help those less fortunate than us. So you all have an amazing evening. You all be blessed and I'll talk to you later.